Hello there, friends. Welcome back to another episode. So today, we're going to get back into uh, Breath of the Wild. So I moved our link around a little bit to the next place we needed to go, simply because I'd moved him to the other side of the world. And we have another one of these to go through. So I used some creative sneaking and got past that guy and just moved over here. We were way over there when we stopped yesterday. So let's get this shrine out of the way. Don't know what this shrine gives us. Don't know what it's all about. But apparently there are good things to have. Those doors are so cool. Here we go. At least he doesn't look so scared when the floor lights up anymore. So that's good. Sleeping in a bed replenishes hearts. Okay, because sitting by a fire does not. So that's good to know. Alright, what do we got to do here? This looks a lot like the other one. To you who sets foot in this shrine, I am Ja Baj. Uh, and the name of the guardian, something something. Okay. So I'm guessing our metal skill or our magnetism skills don't work anymore. So I'm guessing we get a new skill. Sheik is late authenticated. Distilling rune. Remote bomb. So we got two bombs we can use, it looks like. One looks round and one looks square. A bomb that can be detonated remotely. The force of the blast can be used to damage monsters or destroy objects. They are both they are both round and cube bombs, so use whichever best fits the situation. Okay, so we press that and Ah, got it. Take cover. Pretty po pretty potent bombs. Hmm. Wonder if that's the right way to go. Oh, chest. I guess that is the right way to go. Claymore. So we got a two-handed sword. Claymore seems more useful than a stick. I think we're gonna go... Let's 
get rid of these clubs first. That's what's moving. Cool. Blew on the whole wall. Let us proceed. Anything else up here? Can't climb these. So it's th like throwing a bomb around. I got it. Cool. Do I need to do another one? Maybe I should do another one. Some high explosives? No problem. Fire! Well, I got rid of that. What's this doing? So it's just tossing it back and forth. That was cool. What do we got here? Amber. I like how it teaches you by example. That's pretty cool. It's bouncing the ball around, therefore... We can do that. Just kind of glad it didn't kill me. Your resourcefulness in overcoming this trial speaks to the promise of a hero. In the name of the goddess Hylia, I bestow upon you this spirit orb. Spirit orb, symbol that we've overcome a challenge of a shrine. We have two. May the goddess smile upon you.
Oh, that's cool. Wildlife taking shelter under a rock will sometimes jump out when you lift up their hiding spot. Kind of thinking that's where we need to go next. Can I climb this? Oops. Nope. I just want to do that. Got out without uh, getting pounded by the guardians this time. That's always promising. Up we go. Always make sure we look so we don't miss stuff. That's odd. I what the fence is for. Oh, I know. I was a little close to that. Miscalculated. We'll eat some food. Good enough. Flies. I have to steal your honey. Because, you know, it's my job. Can't take the bow. Learn. Can't take the shield. Got too much stuff. Can't take the club. What else you guys got around here? An acorn. Hmm, cool. Oh, it's a lizard. I was wondering what that was. The side of that tree. Alright, how do I get up here? Mushroom. Hey, it's the old guy. Old man's diary. On this desperate, pla desolate plateau, the only pleasure that brings me comfort is cooking. And today I outdid myself. Truly, I created the perfect dish. I call it spicy meat and seafood fry. This recipe not only restores health, but also keeps me warm, even when traveling in the snowy mountains. With this dish on my side, I no longer have need for that itchy, warm doublet. I do not know how I allowed this to happen, but it seems I forgot to write down a very important recipe. 
I know I complained raw meat and spicy pepper, however, I simply cannot remember what else I used. My age is catching up with me. Sadly, on this lonely plateau, I only have my own knowledge and memory to rely on. Still, if I did find someone who knew the missing ingredient, I would happily reward them with my warm doublet. However, it seems unlikely that such a miraculous wish will ever be fulfilled. Baked apple. More shrooms. Not oh, bad. I cannot use this bed. Woodcutter's axe. Uh, we gotta have something in our inventory that's junk. Uh, that's a two. Could probably drop that. So that axe is handy. Handier than most of the others. Fancy that, so we meet again. What are you doing? This body of mine isn't what it used to be. Recovering from a bout of hard work takes a while. If you're hungry, I have an empty pot you can use to cook yourself a meal. Simply open your inventory, grab hold of your ingredients, and toss them in. Try to consider how the ingredients will complement each other. You can even make a dish that increases your stamina. It's all about being creative and trying different things. Don't quite feel like cooking right now. Shroom. Shroom. Another lizard. Man, they just disappear. Sparkly. Some kind of bird. is a long way down. Let's see how we get across there. Guys, watch it. Maybe I'll turn around. Bullseye. these guys out. chest active. Let's go grab the chest. Before we get their junk, let's go get the quest, the chest. Let's see what's in the chest. If it's a sword or some sort. Oh, throwing spear. Let's see what they got. Seared steak. That's helpful. <coughs> it really is. Can't take a shield, can't take melee weapon. Let's 
Sparkly. Noises. Oh, chest. Bomb arrows. Cool. Link is getting overloaded. I think we need to get over there. I'm guessing we have to do this. Can I climb that high? I don't know that I can. We're going to have to take a couple of breaks climbing up here. I don't know if this is the right way or not, but it's a way. I think it just got cold. Yep, I, I just walked into the cold. figure out something. We can't get to that. Not yet. That's where we started. Isn't that where we started? Man, that guy gets around. Let's go check out that fire. opportune time for my weapon to break. Get some fangs. 
Don't really care about their arms. Again, the old man. He's asleep. We'll wake him up. Could you not see I was sleeping? If I can't hunt, what else is there to do but sleep? Sitting by a worm campfire is the best way to pass time. Say, courageous one, are you hungry? If so, please feel free to whip. Uh, to feel free to use my cooking pot to whip up a snack. If you need to start a fire, just light your torch on that campfire anywhere. <laughs> Is the art of cooking captured your interest? I'm certain you have potential. Allow me to give you some pointers. You could toss in anything edible. Thankfully, there are plenty of options in this area. Just remember that the more ingredients you use in a dish, the more health it will replenish when you, replenish when you eat it. Now then, is there anything else I can help you with? The idea is to mix heartier ingredients like fish and meat with things like grains and vegetables. Spices and herbs help too, naturally. However, do not accidentally add in things like bugs and lizards. Let's just say they're not compatible. In fact, they're quite foul. Now then, is there anything else I can help you with? Um, I'm not gonna... It's food. Torch. Let's see. Where are we? There's our first shrine. There's the second we did. The third one is up there in the cold. So I'm guessing the other one's gotta be over here. This bit of ground looks weird. See what is over here. Well, that didn't go very well. I guess that is not actually water. Let's eat some things so that our thing stops peeping at us. And we'll come back later. Okay, so that is the edge of the world. I think we came this way before and there was some really big dude over here.
Yeah, we had to have come this way because those guys are dead. It's a big, big zone. At least it feels big. Hmm, it looks like a way up. Oop. I think we're going to need something a little better than a torch, since we're getting rushed here. Oh my. Well. Sorry about your tree. Are you? Oh, bunch of wood. Portable bundle of wood. Let's go ahead and No, it didn't break. Thank you, arrows. We need more arrows. Ah, sneaky. There's another one. I didn't select anything. Go, cool. I got it. Let's go see what we got. Nope. What are those are good for? 
I haven't found a use for them yet. Alright. That looks like a path up. Well, that's weird. We need a little more stamina to get up there. Or another box. Maybe we'll find another box we can put up there. What do we have here? It's a lot of place. Are there secret doors in this one? Probably is. Top side. Something down there. Can't tell what those are. We'll check those out later. I do think we need to get up there, so maybe it's this way. Couldn't really tell where this went. sufficiently life-threatening, doesn't it? Curious what happens when his stamina runs out. Let's find out. <laughs> ah, that's all. Oh, 
Not what I wanted. found me you're not a Hestu but you can see me I didn't know your kind could see the children of the forest well if you're running a Hestu please return this to him Korok seed seed has been given to you by a Korok it has a distinct smell if you gather a bunch of them you never know what might happen oh and my friends are hiding in lots of different places too don't be shy about poking your nose into suspicious places That might have been a mistake. Yeah, that was a mistake. So that is obviously too far for right now. there were places over further back that were not as severe of a climb. So we'll try those. over here. I think we can make that. If not, we can run over there and pause. Yeah, yeah, we got this. Stuff up there. Let's go see what that is. Some stuff over here too. All kinds of stuff. Whoa. They're like a whole village. Waterfall and everything. up we just hit snow
Can we get to these guys? Maybe? See if we can. <laughs> well, that definitely, um, loosened him up a bit. Go. Cool. I like those spears. What's our award? cool Okay, that's uh, heavy. I think I did that, though. Well, I'll tell you what. Oops. Freezing to death.
Well, that didn't get it. Dang, he's got an arm. I think we're going to need something a little more... Cool, breaking all my weapons here. Spear seems to be working pretty well for us. Bokoblin Guts. Rare material obtained by defeating a Bokoblin. It convulses with, on its own every now and then, which is really creepy, but perhaps it has a use. Oh, broadsword. That could be useful. Got all your peppers. I can't now.
I'm gonna go back to that camp. Something up there. Gotta get up there. There's gotta be a way up there. <clears throat> no, that doesn't do anything. Don't know that this is going to do us any good. No. Well, that could have been dangerous. Ah, there we go. All that for some arrows. Better be some other stuff up here. That must be down low. Oh, one of my arrows, I guess. Gotta be there for a reason. No, I don't see anything. Alright, anyway, we are going to camp out here. And I'm going to look up the recipe for the... Maybe we can get to some of these places we can't get to because of the cold. So I'll look that up for next time and we can whip up some of that, see what it entails. Hmm, I have no idea. Oh well, a little research never hurt anybody. So, that's it for today's episode of Breath of the Wild. Been about a little more than an hour. I uh, feel like we made some progress. We, we killed a bunch of guys. We made it some a uh, little bit further. Finish a shrine. Do another shrine. Hopefully two shrines tomorrow. And um, then we can start working on wrapping up this plateau. Plateau. Plato. Plateau. Such a weird word. Anyway, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you later.